very good afternoon. Welcome to the weekend at the Acciona Open de España, presented by Madrid. With John Rahm able to find his usual magic, it's going to be a new name, surely, on the prestigious trophy. John Rahm out early this morning at three under par. Richard Boxall, Mark Roy, alongside myself, Richard Koff. And what's he been up to? Well, he's hit the fairway. He didn't hit too many of those yesterday. We've got placing here again today. And if you hit the fairways, it gives you a great chance to knock it in close. Which he duly did. Nice start, good crowd following him round. This is for his birdie. Nice start. Got to shut up the next, hard the third. And here he was, just short of the par five. Fourth hole, beautiful chip. Look at that low fizzing, checking chip shot. And up onto the top level, and that would give him another birdie. Yeah, and he added a couple of more at 8 and 10, but inexplicably has just bogeyed the par 5 14th. Leading Spaniard is Alfredo Garcia Heredia. Dropped a shot at the very first hole. This was his second shot at the second. And that was good enough for a birdie. And this from one of the closest challenges to the leader, Mathieu Pavon. Final group, Shabanka Sharma. Very confidently done. Three then now at 11 under par. All playing together. Sharma and Besting joining Pavon at minus 11. 235 for Lorenzo Vera up the hill. Plays about nine extra up the hill. Some wind helping behind them. Kimti's missed the green just to the right. Not far from the flag. Well, he started it straight at the TV tower behind the green. Has he cut? He always got a nice little kick in as well from there. Come round, look at this, you beauty. What a chance he's got there of an eagle. Yes, he can. Two behind. Four, Pavon. Seen Bestling's putt, so he should get the pace. And he does. What a beautiful effort. Easy birdie. to the pin fair. Sharma, you started off with it was a fairy tale win. So just remember, we'll come back to that, Rich, in a minute. Stay there, there's a slope there. Well, there you go, off the left and in. What a good read from Jamie Spence. And what a superb putt from Sharma. Chance, Ron. And only thing in his mind is birdie every single hole coming in. Now, is it time for more cheers? So, yesterday they were catching the lips, staying out. Today's a different feeling for John Ron. I think he's probably hit, you've got it in front of you there, Rich, he's hit a few fairways today, hasn't he? He has, that was actually a par putt. Now here's uh, Gonzalo Fernandez castaño 43 yesterday. And a nice start to the back nine. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, yeah, very much so. 43, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> Ideally, on the eighth, land it just right of the hole and let it spin to it. That's going to pull back. Will it stay on top? Just. Lovely. Good golf course ready, Patrol, because he carries what's like a, a mini driver. And he gives up a bit of length on a lot of the players in the field, but he's a straight hitter. And the last 20 feet is down a big slope. seen that before just the overnight leader has a putt here to get to minus 13 how close are you hoping to be towards the top of the leaderboard come the end of the day 
I think if I can uh, if I can stay within five or six, I think I've done well. I, I fancy uh, fancy Pavon to get to at least fifteen. Well, he's just got to thirty. Fabulous from the Frenchman. You want to aim just to the left of the TV tower and play a draw. If it doesn't draw enough, that slope should work it over towards the hole. Just don't want to short side yourself left. Okay, that's fine in that. Garcia Heredia should have learned something from MLV's putt. Just goes left to right at the end as it loses pace. Fantastic putt. Never finished better than 30 or you know that. seen both with him. We've seen normal grip and we've seen left below right grip on some, but he can't do that and get height. So he's got to really open the club face, throw the right hand underneath, go into orbit. Oh, that was a great shot. That was really good. You know, sometimes people that are not certain around the greens, Boxy, presented with a shot, there is no By other way, option. I totally agree with you. You they have to play the shot. It. You have to, commit to play it. Yeah, exactly. He is striking. Oh. Nice oh. Really well. <laughs> Got great rhythm to the stroke, and the ball is running at the hole, and there's a lovely sound when it comes off the putter head. And I tell you what, Woody's working hard out there as well, isn't he? You can hear his voice all the time, urging his man on. Good caddy. Double breaker, right to left, and once it gets over the hill, it goes downhill, left to right. That downhill last third is going to be tough to judge of the pace. Getting down in two here will be a very good effort. Getting inside a couple feet will be a good effort. You can see there he hits the ridge. See that ball accelerating. Oh, this is wonderful. Incredible. Unbelievable. Wow. Well, we thought Nathan Kimsey was going three shots clear. That's not the case now after Kimsey's birdie takes him to 12 under. Extraordinary. Now, how about a lovely BMW electric motor car, ready? Go for it. What's happening there? I'm sorry, you get nothing for that one. Who's in the port to lose? Yeah, well, nearly out of bounds. Got a free drop from where he was, Eddie Pepper, or not made the most of it. Oh, my goodness me. I mean, he's got a drop that must be 25 yards nearer the flag there. Incredible, isn't it? He's got it. He's got it. <laughs> what a three. My goodness me. <laughs> brushed it in for the simplest of three. Never looked like anything else, did it? Maybe it was just a little bit right of the flag, really, if you can have spin on it. Comes. Oh, too far right there, but uh, they all seem to go in when you get on a streak. Just for four in a row, he's got it never anywhere else. Six under now for his day. Four under for the back nine. Five under his last seven holes. He is on fire, Nathan Kimsey. Pavel, with no green to work with, but the lie's fine. It's fine. Just wants a little soft lob shot here. Get the strike. Yeah, that's OK. Left below right he went there, and yet the brilliant shot he played at 14, the par 5. He didn't go left below right, he went normal. It's a question of what the lead will be for Pavon entering the final round of this Open de España. 
it'll be two. Fabulous finish. Off the back of that bogey at 17, it's a birdie at the last round of 66. And two shots to take into Sunday at the front, looking for that breakthrough win. Matthew, that was a huge part on the last to stretch your lead by two. I mean, you looked quite relaxed on the outside from our point of view, but how did it feel on the inside? Oh, that was good. Um, to be fair, I fought a lot today against my emotions. Um, I like that place, I like that tournament. I know I did great last year, so a lot coming into my head today. But it's all about managing things, and uh, this is what I did today, and I think I did it pretty well. Obviously finished runner-up last year, looking to do one better this year. You know, what have you learned from previous experience and what would it mean to you if you could win? Uh, what I learned is <laughs> that it's tough to beat John Ram. <laughs> last year he got me by six shots and I felt I had a, a great week. Uh, he is uh, this kind of player which are on, on another planet. Um, this week I again just try to do myself. I feel great here. I have some some families from from Spain. My grandfather was uh, from Madrid also. So it's just everything is kind of matching up. Like I'm just happy to be here. I like the course and I'm doing great. So I'm just really enjoying every moment. Well, thank you. Best of luck tomorrow. Thank you. Yeah, nice Spanish connection for uh, Mathieu Pavon. There, his dad also played football in Spain for uh, a season as well in La Liga, big sporting family, but what a day ahead for him. He's uh, 30 years of age and uh, he's yet to win on the DP World Tour. He's had three runner-up finishes, but he's led the way since the opening round of this Axiona Open de España. Can he seal the job tomorrow? To watch another DP World Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.